<laughs> Let's go! Y'all know what this is. Oh my god, I've never seen them perform. I want to. I want to see this. This is an all-time great song. What is going down, world? Welcome to the 40-year-old FUQ Boys podcast. I go by the name Black Pegasus, and um, I am about to watch Journey perform Don't Stop Believing live, 1981. I was one years old, you guys. Now, this song, I know Journey, Don't Stop Believing. Honestly, I didn't even think I would react to Journey on the channel because I was like, oh, I know Don't Stop Believing, right? And you guys asked me to react to, I think it was Faithfully, or is it Faithfully Yours? I think it's Faithfully, and I was like, and so I started going down the rabbit hole because the only song I know of Journey is Don't Stop Believing, right? I never owned an album. This is just that song that you hear at the roller skate rink, you hear on the radio station, you hear at the mall. Like, this is just an all-time epic song, but you guys, I am so excited because I've never seen them perform. I don't think I've seen them perform, just music videos. This is a live performance. So not only am I going to watch the Journey perform for the first time, 1981, when I was one years old, I get to uh, 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 hear one of the greatest songs. Bro, I could, li don't stop, oh my, hey, let's go. If you guys are ready for it, <laughs> like, share, comment, subscribe. Bodie! 40-year-old boys are back in town. 40. Q Boys Podcast. Malt liquor for your ears. 40. All right, y'all. Let me get this logo down and pull the video up. Don't forget to support the original content on the channel. Um, been dropping some music, music videos, and that ain't going to stop. And we're working on some cool original stuff for this summer. When you support it, we can make more of it. And then big shout out to the members, you guys. Um, guys, help us keep the lights on. So I just want to give you a shout out. Thank you for that. And, uh, Yo, if you want to become a member, link is in the description. There's no obligation, but um, yeah, man, thank you guys. Anyways, um, oh, and for the members, some of the videos are going to be uh, disappearing because uh, <laughs> I got some takedown notices from YouTube, but I figure out some, well, you guys will see. I'm working on some stuff, but there will still be more videos. Like I'm always, every day, three videos a day is what I try to put in that membership so you guys get to watch these things early. Um, all right, let's get into it. Boom, by A. Um, Journey, Don't Stop Believing, 1981 Escape Tour. Bro, oh my, just the beginning of this. I'm like, yo, all right, let's just watch this, man, because uh, I've never seen Journey perform. I'm turning this bad boy up in the studio. If you didn't know, I got the Yamaha HS8s or whatever. They're like super nice recording studio speakers, like, you know, for engineers. So, like, I'm just like, Brrr. so anyways, let's go. <laughs> yeah, I'm so hyped. Woo! Those pianos. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Just a small town girl. Living in a lonely world. Hold up. He sounds that good live? No way. Because this sounds like the audio is synced into the live performance. He sounds, oh my, I mean, it's just the first couple of bars, but he sounds just like the goddamn record. Do you know how hard that is to do? Oh my Lord. Just a small town girl Living in a lonely world She took the midnight train Going anywhere <laughs> Just a city This is totally all live. He sounds that good live. No way. This is crazy. A singer in a smoky room. The smell of wine and cheap perfume. Oh, a smile he can share the night. It goes. Searching 
First of all, what the hell is he wearing? <laughs> yellow stun. This, I, my favorite color is yellow. But this yellow top is insane. It's like a leopard cheetah print Tarzan joint. And back then, the pants were tight. And we, us hip-hop kids, you know, because of the 80s, we wore super baggy pants, right? And I actually go back and look at my performances as a rapper and I clown myself because it looked like I was wearing a sleeping bag. <laughs> but these con, these super extremes, like the 80s, we had these tight pants. The 70s, we had the bell bottoms. So the 90s, we just had everything was super baggy. So this is just so cool to see. I'm joking around. The shirt is ridiculous. Let's keep her. It's like some, it's almost like some Flintstone. Sh like, I'm like, what's he wearing? But I love it because this, like, I appreciate that the, in this moment, they captured the 80s and this mother effer's performance, like his voice, he's not a studio singer. There were studio singers back then. People were like, oh, the music. Look, every generation has these, um, like we have Adele. She can sing, right? We the Amy Winehouse a little while back. You go back to these brothers. Every generation has people who are talented who can sing that blow your mind away, right? But we have these studio singers rock stars rappers country artists right that just do it in the studio and they're not this good live so whenever i see this i take time to appreciate it this is freaking amazing i'm about to like jump out of my skin this is so freaking uh and this song obvious knowing don't i want to be at this concert i personally want to be at this concert even though i would only been one years old bruh this looks like so much freaking fun Golly. Two things before you go. One, he personalized the show for Houston, Texas. That was in Houston. He said it multiple times. That's how I know I'm listening to the audio of a live performance and not an overdub track. Two, he's performing without an in-ear. Without the in-ear. I don't know. Like, I perform, you guys, and I don't really use the in-ears like that because it's a personal, personal preference, but everyone has an in-ear so they can hear the audio like they're performing in a recording studio for him to hit those runs and do what he just did off of front wedges that's what they call them the monitors wedges bro this mother effer is the truth the truth and you guys probably already knew that but hey 
that's my first Journey concert, right? Are they still touring? No, because one of them passed away, I think. No? I don't know, man. If they're still touring, I'll go to a show right now. Right now. This, um, bro, legends. Legends. Icons. Freaking amazing. I love it, man. You know, and it's funny because I never reacted to Don't Stop Believing on the channel because I've heard the song, right? I like to do as many first-time reactions as I can, but this is my first time seeing them perform. So being able to watch him perform at that level, like a live show, like he's talking to Houston, he's putting it in the lyrics. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Because I think in the Faithful music video, I think there were like performance shots, but it was a music video. You know, this was a lot. Oh, man, this was so cool. Bruh. Bruh, I wish I could have been there. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, let me know what I got, what I missed. Like, share, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you on the next one. Fody. Thank you for being some man. 40 years down the road back again. F-U-Q, boy.